The following is a selected video from yourteacher.com where you can browse over 450 complete math lessons with example videos, interactive practice problems, self-tests, and more. Try a complete lesson today at yourteacher.com. Now let's graph the equation y equals negative 3x using its slope and y-intercept. The problem here is that our equation doesn't match up quite so well with the formula y equals mx plus b. Our slope, or m, which is represented by the coefficient of the x term, is clearly negative 3. But what is our y-intercept, or b? Well, y equals negative 3x can be thought of as y equals negative 3x plus 0. So you can see that our b, or y-intercept, equals 0. To graph our line, we start with the y-intercept. So our first point is at 0 on the y-axis, and we call that point A. Remember that when your slope is an integer, you can change it to a fraction by putting it over 1. So our slope of negative 3 can be thought of as negative 3 over 1. And from point A, we would go down 3 units and over 1 to plot point B. Connect A and B and we have our line.